lovely. So I thought I'd do the Confessions of a Shoeaholic tag because it's not really one that I've seen going around lots. I have heard of it before, but not many people have done it and quite a lot of you have asked me to do some more tag videos. And I saw this was done by Lexi from So Totally Vlog the other day and I thought it'd just be a really good tag to do. I've just done my shoe collection video, so if you want to see that I will link it in the down bar. So I thought it'd be perfect to follow on that video with this video. The first question is heels or flats? And I would probably say flats. I absolutely love heels. Um, most girls love heels. Um, and if you look at my shoe collection video, you will know that I have quite a few nice pair of heels. But I haven't really worn any for ages because I don't really go out much anymore, but when I do, I tend to just wear flax, flax, flats because they're just more, generally more comfortable and I'd rather just have a good time and be able to dance around than be in heels and after like a few hours just be in pain and just want to sit down because it's no fun when you're like out clubbing with your weights. Number two is what are my go-to shoes and they would have to be, uh, I have two pairs, one of them are just some plain black ballet pumps. I think. The ones that I have at the moment are suede from New Look and I generally go to New Look every three to four months to get a new pair of ballet pumps because they're so handy. I wear them pretty much everywhere. They go with every single outfit. I like that they also show off my foot tattoo as well, which not all shoes do. Yeah, they're just really useful shoe to have. The second pair of shoes I would have to say are some ankle boots and they're like broke ankle boots. They're just black. They're from Office. Um, they're originally £88. I got about... 35% discount on them because obviously I work in office. But yeah, I absolutely love them and I wear them a lot with kind of tights and dresses. Um, I absolutely love those boots. What is my favourite shoe trend of the moment? And oh, I don't know if this is generally something that's majorly as trendy as it was a year ago when it first kind of came around, but I am a sucker for the whole very like chunky shoe and if you have been watching me for a long time then you will know that I am obsessed with chunky shoes. I've asked for a pair of Jeffrey Campbell liters for my birthday next month and um, my favourite pair of Topshop shoes are like proper like chunky heels so I definitely love the kind of like block heel shoes and I also love the twist that has been put on almost what do you call it like granny shoes like you know you have like flat moccasins and flat brogues and flat loafers. I love them in the heel version as well. So what is my least favourite shoe trend? I don't really have one. I'd probably say, I don't even think it's a trend. I can't stand kitten heels. I really can't stand kitten heels. Um, but I don't really think that's a trend. My most expensive pair of shoes, apart from the Jeffrey Campbells that I'm going to get for my birthday next month, um, I'd have to say are my Topshop ones. And I think they were from the Topshop Premium 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 or whatever range that they do and I got them in Oxford Street and they're a block heeled loafer I haven't worn them for a long time yeah I absolutely love them and I think they were 100 110 or something number six is what are your most wanted pair and apart from the Jeffrey Campbell that I'm getting, as I keep saying, next month. It's probably a pair that are in the office sale at the moment and I keep not being able to afford them. They've been reduced to £30 and no one seems to be buying them. Like, I thought they were gonna go really, really quickly when they put, got put on sale. It's been about two months now and no one's sna like, snagged them up. And they're like a um, heel that's probably about that big, whatever, um, and they're kind of like a block heel, and the whole shoe is suede, but it's like a khaki suede, and they're absolutely gorgeous, and I love them, and I really, really want them. Seven is, what is your most embarrassing shoe story? Probably my most embarrassing one was when I was at my friend's 18th last March or something, and I just brought my, like, chunky, wedged, tan, strappy pair of heels from top shop and because it was like the first time I wore them um, I was a bit unsteady on them because the actual wedge is pretty high so they're really 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 comfortable to walk in but when I wasn't used to them I felt a little bit unstable because it was like walking on stilts now I'm absolutely fine in them I've had loads of practice but then I was a little bit like Bambi I was fine walking but if someone pushed me unexpectedly I probably would have toppled over so let's just say after a few too many drinks me and my mate thought let's go on the dance floor he went to go turn around and talk to someone else so he pushed me onto the dance floor I was not expecting to be pushed and I literally just went like slap onto like both of my knees onto the dance floor completely my knees just like 
collapse and I don't I just remembered getting up really quickly and looking around and I don't think anyone saw but I was so embarrassed. Number eight is pick a shoe and share a story. I'm gonna pick my Doc Martens because I wore them to a Paramore concert. I also wore them to my 30 Seconds to Mars concert but the first time I like properly wore them was to my Paramore concert I went to last November with um, one of my good mates Lucy and yeah I just is that a story? Doc Martens are brilliant at concerts not so good with people around me but brilliant if you don't want your own feet stepped on so how many pairs of shoes do I own? god I don't know <laughs> I don't know um go watch my shoe collection video and you'll see but there's like shoes that I own that I didn't even show in my shoe collection video because I don't really like them anymore so I don't know around 20 pairs maybe number 10 is when was the first time you wore heels and I would have to say first time I properly wore a pair of like proper heels I think I was about 15 and I had a pair of heels from office that were from the sale yep I think I still have them and they were like a stony colour and like, like a wooden heel. I wore them to my friend's mum's like wedding party. Question 11 is how much do I spend on shoes and if I'm just getting a pair of flat black like plain shoes, you know like my dolly shoes, I wouldn't want to spend any more than £20 on them because I just don't see the point. But if it's like a gorgeous pair of heels and I absolutely love them, I would spend anything between 50 to about 100 pounds if I had the money that is anyway. My favourite places to buy heels I would probably say a top shop, Jeffrey Campbell if I could afford to shop there regularly. I think New Look are brilliant for heels and they're really really cheap. Question 13 is do I have a pair of heels that I regret buying? I'd probably have to say that the heels that I do regret buying are the ones that I probably will never wear but I absolutely adore them and they are like my dusky pink kind of tied front block heel vintage looking um, shoes from Topshop. Um, they were in the sale so I only got them for £13 so that was really really cheap but they only had them in a size 8 and I thought bugger it I'll just take them anyway. <laughs> um, and if I tie up the ankle straps a lot I could just about walk in them but if I was to go clubbing I probably probably wouldn't be able to walk in them properly because they are too big for me. So I kind of regret buying them in that way but they are a gorgeous pair of heels so I don't regret buying them for that. My favourite pair of heels, I probably have to say, ones I've had the most use out of and are quite statement anyway, are the tan strappy block heel wedge that I got from Topshop and I think when I got them they were about £60-65 pounds. Um, and I absolutely adore them, they're so comfortable and I'm so used to walking in them now and I have worn them a lot and I love them. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this tag, if you want to do this tag then leave it as a video response. Uh, see you in my next video girls, bye!